We are in our garage. We're gonna be going through some of our fan mail. I haven't opened it for like two years. What's in it? Holy shit. Are you ready to play? Play, play, play. Go! Hello. We are in our garage. We're gonna be going through some of our fan mail. The boys probably don't know where our stuff is. It's actually in this box. You know, I've looked at this box that many times and I'm like, we still have this? Oh, hang on over there. What did we use this for? Doesn't even have wheels. Oh man. Oh, so the f got my finger. So we're gonna chuck this box out, but instead I said, oh, let's just keep it. We'll chuck it under there and we'll put all our band. Now let's explain in what's in it. Like, fans have sent us fan mail over the years. Um, and then all <laughs> what else is in it? Pretty much anything related to Sister's Doll, we've put in here, but we actually need a new box because this one is quite full. Everything that we want to keep for Sister's Doll. Doll as a memory or something that's important, we've whacked in this box. What's actually in it? Let's just open the box. They took the box, the mystery <laughs> box. The mystery box. We'll take the box. Hop in. Hop in. <laughs> Hopefully, we've got a raise. Yeah. Oh, the oh, mystery wait. box. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Shout out to Call of Duty zombies. <laughs> I've never even looked in this at all. I haven't <laughs> opened it for like two years. What's in it? I actually yeah, want to yeah. see what's in it. The Undertaker. Ray gun. Holy shit. <laughs> Stuff that we've just kept, and we've like, kept over yeah. years. Like these are some old pictures. I actually might leave these out, and these might be as giveaways in our merch. Look, when we played good things, we had our own little picture for our own dressing room, so we stole it. <laughs> Whose is this? When we left Collie, wasn't it? Yeah, a fan had the idea to make a bear and get fans to sign it. But this is what someone's done. Look at the effort they've gone into. I've never, even seen, I've never even seen this. I've never even seen this. Who sent this? I can't remember. No fucking way. <laughs> Never seen this in my life. I'm sorry I hadn't seen it. How cool is that? That is really cool. Sick. The looks blue exactly like me. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my hair. <laughs> That's cool. Though. That, That's is, that awesome. is really cool. Doll Army is strong. And this is a blanket. Or wow. Sisters Doll Army rock the house. That's so damn cool. Most bands would probably chuck a lot of their stuff out, but we keep all yeah. our stuff. We keep everything, obviously. I didn't even know about this. That Who is did cool. That? It's really mysterious. It's cool. These are promo, good day to be live, promo singles that we sent to radio stations. Never played us. <laughs> Sisters Doll demos. I don't even know what's on here. Oh, they're the original demos. Of all Dolled Up? Yeah. Wow. Our Wait. album launch flyers, there was some left over, so we kept a bunch of them. Some of this shit should be for giveaways, like we might do something with these yeah. posters. This is when we were on all together now. Oh uh, yeah, together. wow. <laughs> Bryce is the best in this one. Just like how he's posing. <laughs> I just look awkward. Me and also look good. Bryce looks weird. And this was another time. It? This was from two passionate fans. Esther, she did this when we left and a lot of effort's gone into that. Esther, thank you very much. We remember you and we can't wait to see you when we come back to WA. Look at this. Oh, are you this, serious? This was our first band comp that allowed us to um, record our first album. Do you want to hold it out? Wow. So this was the grand final poster that Still they- Still in good condition. And we- One. Took it out, which was cool. We are sisters now! This was our start, but um, yeah, Sound Baker, that's where we recorded our album. Look at the date on that, 2011 when we won that competition. That's like, we've been gone for a long time. Here's something that everyone would love to see one day. This is our first ever concert DVD that we did. There's a shout out to Darren Phillips. We featured on that for one of his tracks, which was Heart Attack. It's our good friend from Sydney, he literally compiled all these DVDs. Michael, yeah. He's like, done them all, I think. Yeah, he even did the Australia's Got Talent one. So every bit of footage that we appeared in in Australia's Got Talent, he like Got recorded it and put it on a Blu-ray disc for us, which is I've awesome. been looking for this for ever because that's the footage we don't have that rather than just having random pictures <laughs> everywhere i like oh, kind of just compiled everything into one thing like this is all from fans and i'll just put it in here just so we've got it some old set lists our ep launch hey. all psyched to go austin yeah, yeah. Are you ready to play? There's about 100 to 200 people out there. Oh, that was oh, our first. Oh, that's a 
our first logo. That was our first logo. Serious? And that was our first set list we did. This right, is yeah. our hometown mail. The Collie Mail, so obviously where we grew up. This was kind of a recent thing when we released Black Mirror. The town still supported us, of course, which is great. This is <laughs> from the uh, Dollhouse film clip. If you look up close, look how much effort went into the makeup. This was the original designs that Shakira did for us. And we kind of tweaked it while we are at school. And we just kind of chose the best ones. You used to wear them Union Jack That whole thing, that time. attire there is- And there's that Sage, one. great oh photo. That's the EP these? launch. This was in like the newspaper back in the day, but that's our EP launch. That's me there. Very cool. Oh, Another like great that. fan of ours, Rihanna Chapman, drew these. A lot of work's gone into them. Amy Reynolds drew that of us. I want to show you this. This is taken out of the mail. This might have been the Bunbury mail. I don't know if we've said this story before. In Bunbury. <laughs> right here. This was the first time we ever auditioned for Australia's Got Talent. What? Look, it has our ages. Anyway, so Australia's Got Talent. We auditioned for it years ago. Didn't get anywhere and we're like, yeah, we won't nah, do this again. We'll... Until we got approached to audition for it, and we did, and we got as far as we did. So, who made this? Wait, this is, is awesome. Photos from our Old Old Up album launch. But this was our first ever biggest crowd we played to when we first started. That was like our third gig or something like that, which was like a big family festival over in Bunbury. <laughs> when we went to America. There we are. That was when we supported Crash Diet at the Whiskey. It was packed in there. This is backstage at the whiskey. And Bryce really glammed up there. That was the closest I'd ever get to Marilyn Monroe, so I was quite excited. So when we went and traded DNA with like Kiss. And who would have ever thought, how many years to the date later, to yes. actually be playing with Peter Chris. Peter Chris. <laughs> so look what I'm wearing. And look. Always. Yes, look everywhere. So who made this, Brennan? I can't remember. Anyway, so it's a record, but look closely. The vinyl is cut out to our faces. It's, that that's very cool. That's probably one of my favorite things that we got. And there's another thing which someone has put a lot of work and effort into. Yeah, you know what that looks like? Us loading in to film the Dollhouse film clip. Yeah. Right? That's what I always think of when I see it. But how cool is that? That is really cool. This here. When we're on Australia's Got Talent, we're in TV week. Remember we'd go into Coles, you'd see the latest issue. We all did it once, didn't we? We all went in and bought one ourselves. Yeah, we... But I like bought it and then I was just like, so I'm just gonna say it. And I was like, I'm in that. And she was like, really? And I was like, yeah. Did like, you really? Yeah. We were the only act that got a double spread. On and I'll take you to it was mad. That's another cool picture that someone painted of us, canvas. And like I said, we keep all this stuff. So if you do ever want to send us stuff, we keep it all. All the shows we like, did we keep all the lanyards and stuff? Are we in this? Yeah, yeah I think like for all together now and that. News Weekly. We were in it. Oh. These are all our tour posters. Oh, this will be cool for them to see. This was the original concept art for um, Welcome to the Dollhouse. And I actually like that better, but Bryce wanted to go more simple. But how cool is that one? Wow, we've never shown that before, ever. Brennan's done a great job of scrapbooking all these memories. I drew that one. You can kind of see the cherry lipstick influence there. Blunt Magazine, they don't even do this anymore. But uh, we're in it, wow. we're here. And uh, we're on the CD too, Sisters Doll, Dollhouse, track 18. Wasn't that cool? This was very cool too. We were front page of the Geelong News and that picture is very cool. It kind of captures what we're about. There's more magazines here, but you get the picture, eh? Like, yeah. We're yeah, in smart. magazines, right? We've got a lot of amazing stuff in here that I didn't even know was in there. Brennan saved it all, which is really cool. Did we show these? Who made these? No. They're like glass prints. It's like all glass. So we got three of them. I think we got one each. Bryce drew these. This is from a bass yeah. drum. Is it? Yeah, bass drum skin. And we kept it. Still sticky. So also what we found in our um, garage of goodies, you guys know that we went on tour with Bruce Kulik and Peter Chris. When they toured here, we um, got a bass drum skin made to show our appreciation for playing with them guys. 2015 that was. And then we went on tour with him again in 2017. And then here's the um, incredible bass drum that went on Peter Chris's drum kit when we played with him. I created this design. Peter signed it right smack bang in the middle. <laughs> incredible. I need to pinch myself. Here it is. First ever EP. It's the first thing we like ever recorded and released at the time, eh? There's the tracks. So we re-recorded them songs for, for the welcome, album. 
Who likes the logo better though? And that's it, that's the first EP. So one of the most coolest things we ever received from people. This is, a, this is probably our favorite. Yeah. Little bobble heads, which are awesome. Like there's Bryce as a bobble head. Austin as a little bobble head. And then my little bobble head, but mine broke. So I've had to use gaffer tape to hold it together because my head's too big, it fell. Shout out to Connie for getting these done for us. But the other things are these. Kerry from Aubrey made these. Very unique. I don't think I've ever seen a band have these done before. Yeah. <laughs> what they are is they're like flower pot men, I guess, in a way. Yeah, they're garden did, um, displays. They're like gnomes. Nipple piercings. Yeah. Nipple piercings, tattoos. tattoos. <laughs> the makeup on the face, the headband, the hair. The hair's better than mine. Austin's is very cool too. She got this from the all dolled up era. So Austin's wearing his like the striped striped jacket. jacket, the hat. I wear a lock necklace. So she's got the lock necklace and everything, black lipstick. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and then we've got mine, which I used to wear star converses. <laughs> so they even went to that detail of like the star converses and necklace. Yeah. It actually, it looks like you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really cool idea though, they look mad. So that was another episode of Dollhouse Vlogs where we showcased our fan mail and everything that you guys have sent us. Thank you so much for being a part of our journey for the last 10 years. Share these vlogs, we hope you enjoy them. Rock and roll. Peace. Bubble head away. Don't let your meatloaf. Over and out. Wait, if I drop this right now? We'll put the P.O. Box link in the description if you want to send us fan mail. I've really missed performing. So, I've got a lot of guitars, and this week I'm going to be showing you every single one of them. Feel me? Yeah. Oh, I said, the f***ing got my finger.